case of uh, inferior wall MI and you can see that there is a tight uh, stenosis uh, right about here and uh, it's a 95-99 percent blockage that you can see and uh, very clearly here that the 99 percent the RCA is totally diseased but this uh, portion is really very much diseased so this is a great learning so it is very uh, you know we took a JR 3.5 uh, 6 French wire uh, sorry guide catheter and we took a BMW wire my first choice is always BMW it is my workhouse wire uh, it has a non taper tip and uh, it is very it has a good torqueability and uh, very good uh, uh, it's a very good wire it is 30 mm long and and uh, I formed a knuckle here and you can see clearly I formed a knuckle and this is some uh, aggressive uh, pre dilatation that we are doing this is a 2.0 by uh, 10 mm balloon and uh, we are inflating this 2.0 by 10 mm balloon and we can see that the lesion is giving way and it's good so this is a stent that we are putting it is a 2.75 by 32 mm stent yes, so you can see the stent placement here and the stent is being uh, inflated We are post dilating it uh, with the stand balloon and after this um, it has opened up very nicely where uh, at Agra Heart Center we are always very aggressive about the post dilatation and uh, do post dilatation very much and we found a very post dilatation even in some primary cases and you can see So this is the stent boost and the stent has opened up very very nicely and you can see here but uh, I think uh, on the tightest portion as a pool dilatation has been done by a 3 by 12 mm balloon and uh, NC balloon uh, we use the NC balloon for that and uh, it has been inflated for about uh, 20 to 30 seconds each time for 16 to 18 mm uh, it's 16 to 18 80 mm of pressure uh, very good result and yes so patient was pain free at this time and uh, that's it thank you Agra Heart Center Dr. Rajat Rawat